Hey, Fredo with Siege Off Road. This is our 2018 F-150 that we built for the Ford display at SEMA. We've done an absolute ton of work to it, including the center console vault from Ford. So today we're going to show you how we installed it. This console vault is made of heavy-duty 12-gauge cold rolled steel with a texture black finish with a three-point locking system that resists prying. It features a drill-resistant four-digit combination lock and the door spring-assisted to make it easy to open. It'll give you peace of mind and keep your items safe, so today we're going to install it in our 2018 F-150. Tools you'll need for this installation, a pick or a paper clip, 11 millimeter socket, a 3 8 ratchet, and a 13 millimeter wrench. Before we install the center console volt, we're going to change the combination. To do that, rotate the knob right here and line up this hole to open up the door. I'm going to put this pad right here so the door doesn't close on me. Then you need to take a paper clip or some kind of pick and push in this hole right here. And now you can change the numbers on the dial to your own personal combination. Once you have the desired combination, remove your pick or paper clip. Check and make sure that the lock can turn and you're good to go. We have our combination set on the center console volt. Now before we install it, we're gonna clean out the center console make sure that nothing is in there, including the liner that's in the bottom. We have everything cleared out of the center console. We're gonna lay the support bracket in the console with the front piece facing the front, just like that. But leave it laid down and collapse just like this for right now. Place the volt in the center console. Lift up on the volt. You have to really pull up on the vault so you can get the bracket underneath it. On the front and back of the vault, you'll see there's two studs where the top of the vault attaches to the bracket. You're gonna install the provided nuts onto those studs. Once you get the nuts installed on the front of the vault, you can install them on the rear. Then the nuts can be tightened with a 13 millimeter wrench. Finally, there's two screws that have to be installed on each side of the vault. Once you get the bolt started by hand, you can tighten them with an 11 millimeter socket. Our vault is now secure. All we have to do now is install the foam pad on the bottom, and this is complete. Okay, we got our center console vault installed. This thing is actually really awesome. You could store a lot of things in here. Whether you have a firearm or just want to keep your items protected, it's actually really handy. Installation was super easy. You only need about 10 to 15 minutes, and before you know it, you'll be heading off-road.